Can't help tracking a bit of dust when you come back from the no-rain plains. Yep. Do you have to do that in front of me? Well, nope. Hey, hey you have a burr under your saddle blanket, Colorado. You seem a bit peeved. Well, I just think it's about time you gave me one of those darn deputy badges, Moo. I'm a loyal and trusted cowboy, ain't I? Colorado, you need experience under your belt before you can become a deputy. Help! Anybody, help! Over here! I'll show you how much experience the Colorado kid's got under his belt. Bullseye! Well, Dakota, I guess we better help out Mr. Experience under his belt. Yep. Yeah. Thank you, Marshal. Lovey and I were almost armadillos on the half shell. Oh, oh, it was just awful. Snookums and I were just riding across the prairie. Celebrating a recent gambling victory, I might add. Yes, darling, where we were set upon by a vicious, nasty, and rather foul-smelling scoundrel. Gambling? Scoundrel? Foul-smelling? Know who you mean, Moo. Who? Who? They took everything we owned, including Baby Cake's favorite diamond ring. Yes, yes, and it was cast in the shape of my dear departed Mumsy. My Mumsy-in-law. Uh, and they took it right off of my little fingers, didn't they, Sweetums? Well, there, there, we'll find it, Snookums, won't we, Marshal? We'll give it the old cowlidge dry. Hey, Dakota, put me down! Ace of spades. The calling card of the vicious, foul-smelling scoundrel five-card cud. Um, five-card cud? He loves nothing better than cheating folks out of their money. Unless, of course, it's robbing them of everything they own. We've been trying to catch up with him for years. Well, that sounds just like the scoundrel that robbed us. Oh, Sweetums. Sweetums, do let's go home. I... I can't go on without Mommy's ring. Uh, here, Marshal, perhaps you can use these. They're tickets for the luxury riverboat Dixie Trixie. Uh, consider them a humble thanks for saving me in honey pie. Well, much obliged. A law cow never takes a vacation, but I got an idea who can use them. And we'll keep our eyes peeled for that diamond ring. So Buck, holding the rudder, with his front paws and his corn cob pipe, guided the raft through the rapids and onto the calm shore. Gosh, would I like to live like Buck Finn. Thanks to you, Marshal, we're gonna make a pile of money for the town's education fund. Oh, don't thank me, Miss Lily. Thank that uh, nice armadillo couple. Without their tickets, there'd be no raffle. Well, howdy, calf pint. Howdy, Marshal. Cody, honey, now when you're done with the mopping, could you please polish the brass, put the chairs around the tables, and dust those lights? We just need to get everything ready, you know, for the raffle. Oh, uh, and I'm gonna need some candles from the general store. But, Miss Lily... Ah, uh, uh, no buts, Cody. <laughs> do this, do that. I never get to have any fun. Buck Finn never had to do chores like this. Maybe it's time I tried the river life. How am I supposed to prove to Moo that I'm an experienced law cow when he never lets me get in? Mr. Come over to Hoar from the riverboat Dixie Trixie. <clears throat> Help! Stop. Five card cut has been spotted getting on board at Nelson's Eddy. Stop. Word he's going to take over the. Dot, dot, dot. Stop. Stop? That's all it's saying. Sounds like they're in trouble. W would you get this here telegram to Marshall Montana? Sure thing. Wait a minute. Why do we need Moo for this job? I can catch five card with my hooves tied behind my flanks. 
Come on, Jezebel. We're gonna show Moo just how experienced we are. Yeah! <laughs> For sending that telegram and trying to warn the law, I'm going to gamble with your life. Odd, you're overboard. Even down the smokestack. Any bets? Even. If odd. Odd. Bon voyage. <laughs> Looks like there are plenty of folks to rob on this voyage. Hey, Captain. Ooh. Just so I get my usual 10%, five card. What? You think I cheat you? Hey, what's this? Small change. Uh, yes, five card, sir. Go check the passenger list. Some joker's getting on board, and I don't like his looks. Yes, sir, five card, sir. On the devil. There's no telling who got that telegram. Uh, um, excuse me, but uh, could I see your ticket? I beg... Uh, I beg your pardon. If you knew who I was, you'd know I don't need a ticket. Well, who are you? I'm the famous Johnny Slim, and this is my lucky horse. Johnny Slim? Never heard of you. I'm only the luckiest and richest gambler this side of Sheasel Butte. Well, in that case, uh, welcome aboard. <laughs> we fooled! Just fill the wallet with lettuce and they think we're millionaires. And Moo thought we weren't experienced. When we catch five card with his hooves on that armadillo diamond, we'll be deputies before you can say biscuits and beans. <laughs> okay, Jezebel, let's flip for the top bunk. Hey! Yeah, Buck Finn was right. No chores, no telling me what to do, just floating and fishing. I don't think I'll ever go back to the tumbleweed. Hey, feels like a big one. Uh-oh. Hey, wait, slow down. Hold on. Stop. Oh, help. Help. Five card, sir. Meet Johnny Slim. Awfully young to be a gambler, ain't you? Well, try me and see. Help! What is it? Whoa! Help! 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 <laughs> Ten to one, you can't hook that calf on the first try. You're on! Uh, I mean, you're on. And if I win, I'll see you at the poker table. Yow! Colorado, what are you doing here? Colorado? Uh, he, he must have gotten me mistaken for someone else. <laughs> I've got one of those faces. The only face I want to see is your poker face. You meet me in the gaming lounge in an hour. We'll play a little dealer's choice. You got it. Colorado, what's going on? Shh, call me Johnny Slim. I'm trying to catch that low-down gambler five-card cud. You almost blew my cover. Five-card cud? Golly. Yeah, see, that's my story. What are you doing half drowned in the river? I was just trying to be like Buck Fit. Oh, I heard there was a stowaway on board. You gotta work off your passage, lad. But... Uh, let me explain, Cap. No ticket, no free ride.
Here, saddle sore. Stuff these in that lottery cage. I want to win that riverboat cruise. But that's cheating. Yeah. Howdy, Miss Lily. How's the lottery going? Just great, Moo. Say, you seen Cody anywhere? You know, I, I sent him to the general store, and I haven't seen him since. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what? Buck Finn. I'll bet Cody's taking a river ride. I remember doing the same thing when I was a calf. <sighs> yep. Now, could be I was a little strict with him about cleaning the saloon. Now, don't worry, Miss Lily. Like the code says, being lost is just a matter of perspective. Mm -hmm. Well, Dakota and I'll check it out. Too late? Am I too late for the drawing? Not at all. Miss Lily's just fixing to go picking. I'm surprised to see you back already. Back from where? From the Dixie Trixie, catching five card cut. Didn't Colorado give you the telegram? Mm, nope. Some toilet water you got there, five card. <coughs> Why well, ain't wearing any? What took you so long, stowaway? Ah. Uh, thanks, stowaway. You're welcome, Johnny. Now go swab the dead. <laughs> okay, bets are up. Oh, gee, we're just betting money. I, I thought we might play for something interesting like jewelry. What? Don't you got any cash? Oh, sure, I got cash. How come I haven't seen you around the gaming circuit, Johnny? Probably because I play in the uh, Northern Mesa, mainly around way up here. Well, then you must have run into Snake Eyes Smithson. Oh, sure, Snake Eyes and I go way back. In fact, I won a bundle off him last week. Four aces, I win. That really is a lucky horse. I always win with Chrysanthemum around. I thought you said her name was Petunia. Uh, uh Petunia was my second to last lucky horse. She ran off with a, a dice painter. We'll play again later. I know where you are. Anytime, five card. I love to win. Moo. Good eyes, Dakota. Looks like the calf pines belongings. I sure hope nothing's happened to him. Gotta check down screen. And fast. <laughs> There. This is harder than working at the tumbleweed. That law cow's burning my hide. This is probably what he's after. How do you know he's a law cow? Simple. <laughs> he said he saw Snake Eyes Smithson last week. And Snake Eyes has been five feet under for at least ten years. Really? Yeah. I put him there. What are we gonna do? Throw the law cow overboard? Feed him to the piranhas? No, we can tar and feather him, then feed him to the piranhas. All of it. But first, I want to win my money back. I gotta warn Colorado. Whoops! Look, small change. A little spy. Yeah. <laughs> Pardon me! Going somewhere, Stowaway. Any sign? Where could Cody be? Uh, uh, what's this for? Five cards inviting you to a high-stake poker game in his private cabin. Splendid. I see you're ready to lose some more, eh, Mr. Cud? We'll see. I've already won enough money, so let's try something different, huh? You know, I'm might partial to jewelry. 
especially diamond jewelry in the shape of shelled animals. Maybe. But first, what are you betting? How about this? My great-grandpappy's pocket watch. I was thinking of something more useful, like your lucky horse. What, Jasmine? Oh, Jasmine? I thought you said her name was Chrysanthemum. What do you say, Slim? How about this to match your horse? How about this? You're under arrest by the Colorado Kid, Deputy to be. And how about this? We got you covered. Can we play a different game? So you think you can trick Five Card Cut, huh? Well, one turn on the paddle wheel and five for one you'll change your mind. You're never gonna get away with this five card. <laughs> That's what Snake Eyes Missing said just before I did the same to him. <laughs> Shove him overboard. Oh, no! no! Hear that, Moo? Sounds like the riverboat. Let's rodeo! <laughs> Not so fast, cud! It's the law! <laughs> Ain't that a kick in the pants, cud? Get the boat moving, Captain! <laughs> Thanks, Delphinium. <laughs> a, a joke. It's just a joke, Jezebel. Where is your sense of humor? Thanks, Jezebel. Hey, what about me? I'm going aboard. Yep. Here we go, Cyclone. It's Marshall Moo. Well, I hate the law. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Game's over, five card. Not in my book. Gotta get this ship to shore before we sink. Whoa! Whoa! Hope we make it in time. Laura's down, you fool! I'm trying, sir! <laughs> yippee i yo -okay This cruise ain't even over! Yeah, Rebel! <laughs> nice duds, kid. Moo, well, what are you doing? We're sinking! Doing the best I can, kid. The best I can. Official witness, folks. May I? Get this thing together there and now. Bikes, fillers. You have a nice stay, five cart. You know, I hope you don't get jail sick. Get it? <laughs> jail sick? <laughs> Cody! Oh, thank goodness you're okay. I'm sorry, Miss Lily. Do you forgive me? Oh, Cody, of course I will. I miss you something terrible. You know, working around the saloon is nothing compared to the carefree river life. I take it this is your missing ring, ma'am. Oh, thank you lots, Mr. Marshall. <laughs> and doesn't Mumsy look lovely? Super. Well, that's the last we'll hear of five-card cud. 
Nice work, Colorado. Yeah, but I probably would have drowned or something in the river if you and Dakota hadn't shown up. <laughs> Ain't no probably about it. You know, I've been thinking I, I might need a little more experience under my belt before I make deputy. <laughs> now, where have I heard that before? Uh, say, Marshal, did you use those tickets we gave you? I won! I, I won! I won the lottery! Well, all aboard, Sheriff. But I'm afraid your boat trip is only stopping in one port. Oh! I told you oafs to pack faster! <laughs> <laughs>